obviously I'm here today not only to share my story with you in hopes that it will inspire you, but also to help prevent further injuries like the one that I have, prevent any more injuries from occurring. I never thought that this was going to happen to me. I was never going, never thought that I would be in a wheelchair. So for me, it's about making these kids aware of the decisions that they make. I was just so shocked at how life-changing uh, such a thing could be and that it's really not that hard for it to happen. Well, yeah, life can change in a second. So I made the pretty bad decision to uh, not look for cars before crossing and I ran out and I was hit by a car. was telling me in the early days, you know, Rhiannon, everything happens for a reason. I wanted to punch these people, but I was paralysed, so I couldn't. It's really inspirational and it's just a really good lesson to learn as well, especially, like we said, at our age, it's good to hear someone's story. I need 24 hour care, can't feel anything, and I can't breathe it, breathe at all. So it's had a pretty big impact. So, being paralysed obviously is the worst, but being able to be here and share my story is incredible for myself. How could you not have a connection with Rhiannon? She's such like, she has such charisma in telling her story and she's so like genuine in who she is as a person. Can I give you a hug please? Please. <laughs>